Hi. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Dyson launches shopping experience on Meta. In time for the festive period, electronics brand Dyson launched a new virtual reality experience to help shoppers explore their products. The virtual store is available through the Oculus Store on the VR headset by Meta, formerly known as Facebook, and is called the Dyson Demo VR. The VR store allows users to walk through a virtual space and examine 3D images of Dyson beauty tools, vacuums, and other products and home appliances. Like in a video game, Users can virtually pick up the items, examine them in 3D and test them out virtually. News source, Oculus, the former head of 3D design at Nike has joined the DAO focused on creating virtual NFT fashion items as their head of cyberware. If you're still not sold on the deck, watch where the talent are headed. News source, Hype Beast, Snapchat using augmented reality to create holiday market for top brands. Starting on Black Friday, Snapchat users will be able to access an augmented reality holiday market through the Snapchat app. The holiday market will feature immersive augmented reality experiences from partner brands including Coca-Cola, Hollister, Prime Video, Under Armour, Verizon, and Walmart. Shoppers will be able to browse products and snag holiday deals by accessing each brand's custom augmented reality lens space on the app. News source, Snapchat First Match announced it would transform dating in the metaverse, and now Bumble, the online dating app, intends to develop a metaverse platform for users to engage and meet in the virtual world. CEO Whitney Wolf heard said Bumble BFF could potentially become a leader in the Web 3.0 world. Does it make sense for Bumble to build on the virtual platform? The company claims that the BFF platform was already built on the blockchain, where users can interact, engage and create their own service experiences within a virtual community. News source, NFT Evenings, Seoul, South Korea, will ring in the new year and the metaverse. The city plans to become the first municipal government to offer full services in the metaverse. Seoul plans to complete its digital world by 2026, however, the city will roll out several virtual services in phases next year to kickstart the platform and create early adoption. Participants will require augmented reality tools, such as goggles and controllers, to enter the metaverse and utilize its services. The newly elected mayor has a plan to push forward frontier technologies with a $34 million budget to create the metaverse. News source, The Seattle Times, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.